So as you may or may not know, ZipPay just recently came out with a physical card that you can use in the stores. I just got mine in the mail, so yes, I'm so excited, ready to try it out. But in today's video, I'm just gonna share with you what I know so far about the ZipPay card, so keep watching. What's up, guys? It's your main man, Jeff, from IAT2GM, back with another video. So as I just recently stated, guys, in today's video, I'm gonna talk about the ZipPay card. Yep, I got mine in the mail as well. I'm excited, very excited. I was I was hoping that they would actually do this because usually, um, if you want to pay in store, you could you could go through the app and then use your phone to pay via Google Pay. It's that's how it works that way. If the store that you goes in you go into accepts Google Pay, but most stores don't because I tried and they say I don't take Google Pay. So they came out with a physical card, which you see on the screen now, that you can actually use and, and um, pretty much replace the process of using the card, the um, cardless contactless reader. If a brand, does, if a store uh, that you want to shop in doesn't have it, so what I want to do is just share with you more about the ZipPay card. First of all, if you're if you don't know what ZipPay is, it's a paying for app that pretty much allows you to make purchases where Zip would make the purchase for you, and then they break down um, that purchase into four bi-weekly payments, and then you end up paying um, you end up paying Zip. But I got a review video that I did a while back. You can actually check that out. This is it right here. Um, I'll put a link in the description where you can go and watch that review video and you can learn more about Zip if this is your first time even hearing about it. But let's get straight to it. So we on the Zip, the Zip Pay card page. Make space in your wallet. The Zip Pay is here. Zip Pay card or Zip card is here. So. You can use it nearly everywhere, whether it's groceries or on a TV. If there's a payment terminal, users can swipe, tap, or dip the card to actually pay. I'm excited about this. I've been waiting on them to get a physical a physical card for the longest, and it finally happened. So take your items home today, enjoy your items today, pay for them over time, just simply pay for your purchase over time to match your cash flow. Easy as that, like I said, um, they pretty much break down the pay, um, the transaction amount into four bi-weekly payments, and then you're just paying zip back. You can pay them on your own, or they can automatically take it out your choice. But um, at first, they will take it out automatically unless you choose to pay ahead of time. Transparent terms. So we're on your side. The zip card does not affect your credit. So even though this is technically used as a credit card, it's technically used as a credit card, They it doesn't affect your credit at all just so you know i'm in the process of actually building my credit up um and i've been using zip for god knows how long it's been over a year since i've been using them and i would say zip is amazing guys zip is amazing so let me go ahead and show you the package and i took a picture of it and this is what i received in the mail so pay later in store so this is the zip card itself as you can see right here this is how it works so you can scan the qr code which is this qr code right here you can scan the code on your zip card on, on, on your zip card or open your zip your zips app in store tab okay once you do that you can enter the purchase amount that you're going to use once you and then once you finish doing that you can swipe tap or dip your zip card to complete payment simple as that so it's the same thing you would do inside of the app but now you have the card to physically go in the store and do so so um types of brands that you can use it for um i've used it to pay phone bill to pay my phone bill before i've used it to pay uh my internet bill before i've used it to in walmart amazon i bought groceries with it just to test it out to see if it actually works now i'm talking about zip pay i haven't tried the card out as of this video because there's not much to say about the card, but I just want you guys to see that it is the real deal. I did receive it in the mail and I will start using the card. I'm gonna record myself doing those transactions so that way I can do another video, a follow-up video on using the zip pay card. So that way you'll be able to see, your, see for yourself how to use it. But in so many words, we physically, you have a car, a physical card that you can now use. Um, like I said, I used to use it in, I tried to use it in store in Walmart and they, some of the Walmarts I happen to go to, 
They don't have the contactless reader where you can use Google Pay. Um, Zip Pay you, allows you to connect your your personal credit or debit your debit cards or um, your payment cards through Google Pay, and then that's how they go ahead and connect between them and then Google Pay, so that way you can pay um, at the terminal using your phone because they didn't have a physical card yet. But now that they have the physical card, now you be able to actually use the card itself. But guys, other than that, that's what I just wanted to say in this video. I know it's not much because they haven't came out with a lot of information when it comes to it. But just to answer a few questions, one I've gotten, does this uh, mess with your credit? No, ZipPay doesn't run your credit at all in order to um, in order to approve you. I remember when I got started with them, I think my starting pay, my starting amount was like $300 they gave me when I first started. Um, the one thing I will say is that ZipPay are I'm still haven't figured out how ZipPay figures out the amount that they want to give you. Um, what's the highest amount that they want to get that they will give you? I do plan on finding that out and doing future videos on that because I have I've had subscribers reach out to me and ask for that. <clears throat> but the main question is, it doesn't affect your credit. It does work like a credit card, just like you would use it for anything else that you buy. Uh, however, there are certain things that you can't. Um, certain things that you're not able to use zip pay for there are some merchants that may not accept zip so be uh, be on the lookout for that as well um, again right now zip is uh, the zip card itself if we go back to here we go down here we can see right now the zip pay card can only be used in US in-store purchases certain merchants products goods and services restrictions do um do apply okay so just so you understand that there are some merchants that zip just doesn't um accept right now some merchants that zip doesn't work with at the moment and hopefully that would change in the future but i'm just excited right now for this zip pay card um like i said i'm going to start using it um and record a few transactions so that way you'll be able to see for yourself how to use the zip pay card for yourself the best recommendation i can give you is to use it for a lot of things so that way you can build up good payment history with zip they see that you're actively using it and they can eventually start upping your amount um, right now i think my total amount is maybe close to 400 dollars or something like that um again i don't know how the the, the algorithm works or how does it work as far as them um upping raising your your limit that you can use again i'm going to fan out a lot of answers to some frequently asked questions and start doing videos about them let me know in the comments what be what answers what questions would you like me to find answers to and i will do a video for them but with that being said guys i appreciate you watching today's video if you got any value out of it just please i, I really um would love for you to like the video helps with the algorithm gets the channel out to um, a broader audience be sure to subscribe to the channel um, as well hit that bell button so that way you always be notified every time I upload content with that being said guys I catch you in the next video and as I always say don't just hustle for the fame hustle for your last name I'll see y'all next video take care